Hi everyone! So, my anime order got here today. It's the stuff I ordered from Sentai uh, for the Black Friday sale. And what's funny is that it's, it's from Sentai, ordered from Sentai, yet it says it was <laughs> shipped out by right stuff. <laughs> So I'm assuming they ended up not having some of the ones I wanted in their stock and they probably asked Ride Stuff to provide them um, with some of that. I don't know. I'm really confused because Sentai and uh, Ride Stuff are completely separate things. And when I ordered from Sentai before, it came from Sentai. But whatever, it doesn't matter. I just thought it was funny. But here we go. And these are a series that I always wanted to get and I always hesitated because... Well, for one reason or another, right? I always hesitated. I always ended up getting something else or... Well, yeah, basically, I ended up getting something I wanted more. But this time, the prices were just absolutely too good to pass up. So, yeah, yeah. Ooh, pink paper. <laughs> so, only one thing did not get here today. Um... And that would be, yeah, it's on back order. So that's probably going to be shipped out. Uh, well, it said it was going to be shipped out in December, which is when I got, I mean, it's December. <laughs> so I don't know why why it wasn't included in this, but I guess they just they just don't have the stock in still. That's basically it. They just, obviously everything's still delayed. So um, yeah, they probably just didn't have the stock of it yet. Okay, so... Go. Yay. Now, so it's the complete series of Majestic Prince. Uh, to be honest, well, I did like the series. It's not that I didn't like it, but it wasn't my favorite, but I got it because it was only four bucks. <laughs> like, the sale was ridiculously amazing. Or six bucks, either way, it was so cheap, and I was like, "Fuck yeah, I'm not gonna pass that up," you know. So even though it wasn't my, definitely wasn't my favorite uh, as far as a Gundam series goes, but I mean for that price, I liked it enough that I will rewatch it, you know. So not over and over specifically, like I do like uh, Eureka Seven or Gundam Seed, and you know some of those other ones, but. Um, it was it was it was good enough for me to get at that cheaper price. So yay, finally got that. I actually also got Devil Unrealist. Now the reason why I was hesitating with this one is because it isn't dubbed. And yeah, you're like yeah, dubbed, so whatever. But I usually like when I want background noise, I switch it to dub so that I won't get distracted and want to watch it in sub. You know what I mean? So that's why I hesitated in buying this one. But I did like it as well. And this one, I actually watch it constantly over and over on Crunchyroll because it's still available on Crunchyroll. So I watch it over and over on Crunchy. And so it's kind of like, well, I didn't have to buy it either because I watch it constantly on there. But Crunchyroll does sometimes delete anime from their catalog. Uh, that's what happened <clears throat> with um, Betrayal Knows My Name or uh, Uraboku. And so... I was like, well, I'm going to get it then because I really wanted it. And here's my chance. This one was also ridiculously cheap. Also around the only uh, four, uh, sorry, uh, six, yeah, six or four dollar price range. It was very cheap. So again, it was too good to pass up. So I got it. Yay, Devil and Nihilist. Okay. And it's also Slash. So yay. <laughs> and then I got um, Hitoro Jime, my hero. And it's a yaoi, or it's very slash, actually. It's more, it's not explicit at all, so it's always fade to black. So, but it is a yaoi. And yeah, I, again, this one was also really cheap. And this one is sub and dub. And I got it, I think, for only 12 bucks. Uh, right stuff is a dollar more, so if you want to get it, Go to Right Stuff right now. They have their holiday sale and they are amazing prices for some stuff. Like Hitoro Jimmy, my hero, is $13.99 and I got it for $12 at Sentai. So it's just a buck more, just slightly different. 
uh, I mean, if you want this anime bad enough, it's worth it, I think. Especially because it does include the dub. So, I jumped on it, I got it. And yay, it's finally mine. And this is another one that I watch constantly on Crunchyroll, so... I was like, well, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to get it now. <laughs> Anyways, and then finally, finally, I have The Familiar of Zero. Um, this is very, um, what does it call it? Seni? No. Is that another term? Echi? Shonen? Whatever. But um, it's the complete series. I think it's uh, four seasons plus OVAs. And... It's only sub. This one does not come. Oh, wait, it does. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I think only the first, yeah, see, the first season comes dubbed. The rest are only sub. So, four seasons, yeah, and then the, the OVAs. So, only the first season is dubbed. I guess it wasn't that popular. But I decided to get it because I actually really like this series. And this is another one that I constantly watch my favorite episodes on Crunchyroll. So why wouldn't I get it now when it was super, super cheap to get? Like, considering it's four seasons of anime, half dub, the rest sub, I mean, it doesn't really matter, but it's the whole four seasons, plus OVAs, I thought it was too good of a price to pass up on Sentai. I don't know how much it is on Right Stuff. I didn't check. The only one I did check was Hitorojime because I um, compared them. Uh, I also didn't check any of these if you're interested in Majestic Prince or Devil in, uh, Devils and Realists. But, um, yeah, so, very short. <laughs> but those are the reasons why I hesitated in getting them before and why I decided to get them now, because they're just really, really, really cheap, and it was too good to pass up. Um, but yeah, again, check out the anime, I'm sorry, uh, check out the Right Stuff holiday sale, because the anime is super, super cheap right now. Also, a lot of merchandise, like uh, plushies and totes and things like that all of that is really really cheap right now um i do have a lot coming again i've ordered a lot from the holiday sale already <laughs> oh rip my wallet <laughs> oh god i went through so much but it's my anime you know so i'm gonna i'm gonna do it <laughs> but yeah so look forward to that hopefully um eh, probably i'm probably not gonna get them until uh January so that's gonna be early New Year openings uh, I don't I honestly don't think I'm gonna get anything before Christmas which doesn't matter I mean they're just for myself I'm not ordering any presents <laughs> well I mean I am but <laughs> not anime wise so yeah that's about it uh thanks for watching once again check out the right stuff holiday sale it is on right now and you're gonna get great discounts and deals on some anime that was ridiculously expensive before especially some of the um Aniplex, dude. Aniplex is so freaking expensive. And I have my eye on a few things now that are considerably cheaper. Still pretty high up there on the price range, but way more affordable than it was way before. Like, ugh, I hate that Aniplex is so expensive. Especially since the majority of them are not dubbed. Like, I, want, I really wanted to get uh, Irregular at Magic High School. But... Mm -hmm. No, that is way past my usual price range. Now, you could compare me getting Gundam Seed uh, Ultra Collector's Edition, but it included the original dub, plus the new dub, plus yada, 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 you know? And it has a lot, uh, like, um, well, not a lot, a lot, but it does have an extra poster, and it has, you know, the character profiles and, you know, sketches and things like that. And... For instance, yeah, um, Irregular Magic High School. Oh, it's, it's, it's just, it's just the Blu-rays and, like, the DV, the, the Blu-ray discs. That's it. So, there's nothing extra in there that would, you know, compel me to get this series. Like, if it was at least in a special limited edition box, it would probably be more worth that price. I mean, uh, it, whatever. It, it is what it is, right? But basically... Go check it out because everything is way more affordable now. And they add new things every, every week until I think it ends on uh, the 24th. So it ends on Christmas Eve. So once again, check it out. Get your deals if you can. And yeah, that's about it. <laughs> so thanks for watching and always listening to my rambling. Again, I have a few things coming in later. 
And if I mean if I get them early, early unboxing, right? So that's that. Okay then. Stay safe out there, wear a mask, and I'll see you next time. Bye!